on some planet, a blonde dude is doing a scene from Cliffhanger with Stallone, and like the video game, it doesn't go well. The Jewel revived me, like in the 2010's Thundercats. Now for my homeland of Deadlander. Meanwhile, later and somewhere else, Pandora faces a gang of dimension criminals named after the invid inorganic cougar, and her hair went echo with a dual power, but two of them got away because she forgot to finish one off. Sorry I was late, I couldn't get the chocolate off my face and didn't want to be called racist, so I went mummy. After Lamia got ice, you sure got better with the jewel, like Muso Tensei in Hope to No Ken. One scene of Pandora swimming nude and coming out of the water to Pose as Kue notices her tight toned 80s chick bod later. Kue, why were you checking out of my curvy new body? I thought you were into little boys. Oh no, the gang took our spaceship and the jewel is inside. <laughs> So, they find it was actually some little blonde boy, like from Boku no Pico, named Sotho, who was taking the ship as he needs to get to Deadlander, which is an extinct dimension and the kid's homeland. I sent the bounty to your bank account. As for Deadlander, it's coming back to life, and all these dimension crooks are headed into it. Then, we get bonus pay for doing a harder mission. Can we do the contracts? Me and Sotho will be doing non shona things. There's something about this Sotho kid. He wants to go where the cooks are. I think something's up. We gotta go through Fueta to get to Deadlander, but we need more bounties to make up lost money. Or we might have to start doing both stuff. And so, Sotho dreams of the blonde dude from before with the girl who looks like the tour guide from the Underworld Yu-Gi-Oh card. Then they space forward like in Robotech. Sotho is now a kid, but once he grows up, we'll become one. And so, Pandora has extra time and stops by the beach, but not to wear a skimpy bikini like in Sailor Moon and talks with Sotho about how she has the jewel of Lupia that fights evil, and the kid would be better with the blue jewel of Andorra. But the base blows, and the gang she faced before is back for revenge! And so, Pandora fights the gang, but Sotho gets it in the back like that kid in Violence Jack OVA1. Then Kue shreds him like it's the 1927 movie Wings, but Sunrise was the year's better movie. I'ma fix the ship so we can get him healed in another dimension. And so, Sotho dreams of the scene in the start where his girlfriend Fontaine fell and calls for him in real life. In Sailor Moon, the Silver Crystal heals people. Maybe this can help Sotho. <laughs> Another flashback as this is turning into Tenjo Tenge, the god of the blue light, tells Sotho to find Fandora and save Fontaine in Deadlander. I hear his heartbeat. He's alive. And whoa! He's grown hot. Kui, Sotho is alive! And so, 
the god of the blue light tells Sotho to steal the jewel and the ship and go to Deadlander. But he don't wanna. Wow, he's bigger than me. I wonder if his man parts are too. Thanks for the help, but I must go alone. Something bad is in Deadlander for me. I don't want you to be harmed. We can't let you go alone. Also, we already got paid to go there. And so, as they space fold, Sotho talks with Fandora on if his girlfriend sacrificed herself or if he let her go, and he needs to know. This area looks like it did before the dimension collapse. I'm devolving a bit. It's the artificial sun. Let's go to the tower. Dimension crux. Let's go in. I think the Endor jewel is involved. Beast mode. I was waiting for you, Sotho. Forgive me for leaving you behind. It's okay. It was an accident. Well, actually... My job's done. You two are together. Now you can get married and get her pregnant. Wait, Fandora. I know you're into him too, but I'm now a priestess of the Blue Light God who uses power to uncollapse Deadlander. But his power is at its limit and we need to destroy this dimension collapse whirlpool to save it. The Red Jewel must become a Red Sun, and the boy joins with the Blue Sun to revive the dimension. That is what our God says. I'll give it back when the dimension is revived. Sure. Can't be used by bad guys. So? It's safe. And so, Sotho told the Jewel to save the land and flew up like a Sailor Moon R the movie. But Kue saw it and devolved back to his dragon form. And in the Blue Sun... Wait, Blue Sun? Sounds like a JRPG. He meets the blue light god, and it's Yogu Sogos. But then Kue comes in, and Sothos gets his face shanked. I'm sorry, but it's what my god wants. Yogo Sogos is alive somehow! I gotta save Fandora! Dimension criminals? Oh yeah, I forgot about them. Fuse with me, Soto. Like E-Hero Neos and Cyber and Dragon. And so, we get that flashback again and see Sothos got hit by locks and it made him queer out and drop his girlfriend. I remember now. I let go. Oh, I'm Yogo Soto Sogas. Yes, and you are me. Good thing I brought weapons. Otherwise, I'll be like one of those dinks from Destination Truth. Or 2001 A Space Odyssey. Who go unharmed into deadly places. And so, Kue goes in and shreds the badge like it's wings from 1927. But his ship blows and Fontaine slices Fandora. Is this the end like in Devilman? I'ma save Fandora! Not if I do this. The jewel protected him. I did it all for me, Sothos, Deadlander, and its blue light god and hero, Yogu Sogos. Now, to kill you. Wait, Fontaine. You ought to shank me. I let go of your hand. Bad news, Fandora. I'm Yugo Sogas, before I got the Endora Jewel, but was made of his good side. So the Jewel didn't reject me, like Ryo and Honey Asuka in Violence Jack. Now he wants to kill me to become more evil, like Noraku and Inuyasha. I know what to do. Your turn! <laughs>
all got away. But it's okay, as no one can stop me today. And so, like out of the Shira cartoon, Kuei flies in space with Pandora out of the ruined land. Wait, didn't Go the Guy Chibi World do this in OVA 3 with them going out of the violence jackland?